Strenuous physical demands, or is the city just not looking in the right places? News 5 is always investigating, this time, why Cleveland Fire hasn't hired a woman since 1989. Only on News 5, Kevin Berry speaks with, with one of the three women in the department about what has to happen to get more women in their ranks. When the fire department shows up to save your house, you know they can because every firefighter in the region has to pass physical tests like this one. Set, go. Just to get hired in the region, firefighters have to finish the course in four and a half minutes wearing this 20 pound pack. And when you're picking up a 40 pound hose, you're only getting started. Daniel Waitkiss is the fire training commander at Cuyahoga Community College. In the first five to 10 minutes on scene at a fire, Firefighters are doing some of the most uh, physically demanding work um, that one could ever encounter. Physical demands are part of the reason Fire Chief Angelo Cavillo gave to the city council when explaining why the department hasn't hired a female firefighter since 1989. It's a barrier to anybody that walks in and ha doesn't know how to prepare for it. Battalion Chief Deborah Schrader is one of three women left in the department and says it's more about building community for women to succeed. If you teach them the right, right way that they, because of their body, should swing something or should carry something, then they'll just do it because they want the job. Schrader says it doesn't just start with the 3% of female cadets Tri-C says they usually have in their program. Younger girls would see female firefighters on a scene and then aspire to be one, just like they already do when they see female police officers or paramedics. When I would drive on the fire truck, fire rig, then people would point like little girls or ladies would point like, look, there's a female. Schrader became a firefighter with a group of other women all at once. She says she wants to build that again. I would tell them to call yeah. me, <laughs> you know, and um, I'm, I, I want my next generation of women on the Cleveland Fire Department. In Cleveland, I'm Kevin Barry, News 5. And as Kevin said, Cuyahoga Community College says they see about 3% female cadets in their firefighting training programs. That is close to the national average.